Ah, shit. Here we go again. What's up, everyone? Welcome back to another GTA Trilogy video. We are less than two days away from this game releasing. And Rockstar, you know, they just can't be normal. They, they, they can't. It's impossible for them to be normal. So instead of giving us, like, you know, a gameplay trailer, which most other studios and people trying to sell their game, they would do. Rockstar said, you know what? We'll give you guys some gifts. So that's what we're going to be taking a look at in today's video. The gifts of the gameplay. I don't know if this, uh, you know, is a good thing or a bad thing. Does this mean Rockstar is not confident in showing the gameplay? Or are they just being secretive because they are trying to build the hype? I'm not sure what they're thinking behind the scenes. But regardless, the game comes out in two days and we have some gameplay gifts to look at. And of course, I mean, look, this is the classic, the iconic meme. And it looks great. It looks phenomenal. I mean, the, the lighting, the clouds, the trees. This honestly might be one of the best gifts uh, in the whole batch, which makes me excited to play this game. Now, of course, there's obviously still the issues that I brought up with like the textures on the actual body, like the belt and stuff. But, you know, I guess it is what it is. But anyway, let's let's get into the other gifts. Let's get into the other information. So uh, this was the Newswire posted today, now available. Uh, I guess you can see these gifts on Instagram, TikTok, and more. So uh, I'll leave a link to this Newswire as well as the official Giphy page, which we're going to be taking a look at here in a second. Here's another GIF of Tommy throwing the phone. Uh, Tommy's looking a little better in this one. Not a stick. I do like that. But uh, I guess this one just showcases the lighting again. You can see the shadow when he throws the phone. Looks great. Uh, actually, at the top left, there's like a fan going on, you can see, which is cool. And then we have another GIF of GTA 3. This one, I think, was in that little teaser trailer they showed, but it doesn't really showcase anything special. Honestly, I don't even know why they're showing this GIF off of GTA 3, because I think there are much better ones. This one kind of makes this guy look a little weird, but it is what it is. But uh, before we even get into the GIFs, the only other thing they posted was this this was from the rockstar support and you can see this is talking about the release time because i've seen some people confused saying they're gonna like change their time zone to new zealand or something to get it early but you you can't do that with this this uh, this release because this is a global release at the same time for everyone no matter where you are so GTA will officially launch at 10 a.m. Eastern in all regions across all platforms. So figure out wherever you live, what 10 a.m. Eastern converts to your time zone. Because if you're in like Australia or New Zealand, New Zealand, it's actually going to be Friday. I think like Friday morning. Uh, obviously UK, it's like five or six hours past. If you're in West Coast or something, it's going to be before. But 10 a.m. Eastern. So everywhere in the world gets it at the exact same time. And there are some issues they say here with the PlayStation tour stores timing or the countdown timers, but it doesn't matter because 10 a.m. is when it releases. Okay, so with that out the way, let's get into the gameplay. And uh, here we are on the Giphy website. This is Rockstar's official Giphy page, I guess. I, again, man, this is such a terrible way to like view this stuff. I'm telling you. But uh, before we actually get into the gifts, even though I know we said we're getting into the gifts, there's actually some cool things they posted in addition to the gifts. They posted all these other stickers and stuff, but the important one, if we scroll down here enough, look at this. There's actually a skateboard. And apparently, according to uh, some people who much more involved in the San Andreas scene, apparently this was a cut item from the original game. So maybe we're going to be getting some of that cut, those cut items back, like skateboarding, uh, there's another one here, uh, the hockey stick. So this could be pretty cool. But anyway, okay, finally, let's go back up and get into the GTA Trilogy, the Definitive Edition GIF page. And uh, the problem is with this stupid website, you can't just go like one by one. You can't just, you know, go, all right, let's click on this one and then go next. Mm -mm. If you want to actually see it in good resolution, that doesn't, full screen doesn't even work either. Because if we go back here, I mean, this looks way better. So I... Rockstar, this is the kings of doing the dumbest stuff, I swear. This is a Rockstar logic, basically. But uh, we already saw this one. Now we have some other ones. So I guess we'll just go one by one and, you know, see what's happening. We have CJ picking up some 
some luggage from an airport. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Then we have a GTA 3 gift. I'm not to be trusted. And I'm telling you, the, the, the foliage is definitely going to be one of the best parts about these games. I mean, just it, it looks so much better than the original games. Let's just go through a couple of these and see what's happening. I guess is another GTA 3 one. Honestly, again, the GTA 3 characters, I think, apart from that old guy, I think these kind of look the best out of all of the games. Not really a whole bunch going on in the background. Here's another one, if we full screen it, of the uh, the foliage and stuff in the background. You can see the forest. It actually looks like a forest compared to what it was, you know, in the older game. Here, I guess, is just another screenshot of, like, maybe one of the cutscenes where all the homies at. You can see inside of the house. Again, here we have CJ, I guess inside of CJ. So I haven't played San Andreas, so this will be my first time playing through it. But uh, you can see textures and stuff. Inside, I think the interiors, apart from the lighting, I think, you know, these definitely look more old school than some of the exterior shots. I'm not going to go through every single GIF. You can go through them if you want. But uh, here we have actually kind of a weird GIF. Uh, is this VCR or whatever it is? Is this floating? It looks like it's floating. It doesn't look like there's a shelf there. So, uh, okay. Already seeing some rocks or logics. But you can see actually when he shoots, you have some uh, some nice little muzzle flash, I guess, which is cool. This is actually one of the better gifts here. You can actually see some of the reflections, which look phenomenal here. I can't slow this down because, again, this is a GIF and Rockstar can't just give us normal gameplay. But on this right-hand side, you can actually see the color of Tommy's shirt sort of blue as it as he jumps in. So, so again, I mean, the lighting and stuff, and even when it turns, you can see the sunset, I guess, the lighting. I, I can't. I think that's going to be the best part, just the lighting and everything. Now, here's one we can actually see Tommy on a boat. You can see the dock in the distance. I just, I don't know, the faces. It is what it is. Here we got one of Tommy slamming the door shut. You can see, I guess, the uh, the shadows looking pretty solid. This is GTA 3. I'm assuming a cutscene or something. Not really a whole bunch to, to see from a lot of these gifts. They are just sort of, I guess, cutscenes. This is another one. I guess maybe you can see the, the character models in action. And, I mean, as you can see, I'll just scroll through all of them here. You can see just a lot of them are of just the characters interacting. So, not not showing too much gameplay, which is unfortunate because, like, this one, of course, the, you know, ah, shit, here we go again. That, it looks great. So, like, the I, I don't know why Rockstar's not showcasing the actual game and instead showcasing these, like, kind of not good character models. I don't know, Rockstar just doesn't make any sense. But I'll leave a link to these to this page if you want to i guess go through it there's not a whole bunch i guess you could see but it is something so if you've been wanting something then here you go but yeah anyway two days left and uh, the final thing we'll leave on is here we got this guy made a nice comparison and this is what i'm saying like the old game up top obviously the new game the new game it looks great why are they not showcasing more of that but it's rockstar what you gonna do Anyway, when this game does come out, I know I haven't mentioned it, but I will more than likely be live streaming this. I don't know if we're going to start with GTA 3, GTA San Andreas, or Vice City, but I'm more than likely going to be live streaming it, playing it, seeing what's good. We'll be playing it on PC so we can hopefully play in 4K, see what the best graphics settings are. So if you are wanting to see that maybe before you purchase or something, then definitely be on the lookout for that. We will live stream more than likely just when the game comes out at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. So maybe tomorrow I'll make a separate video if there's any other new information detailing the plan I have. But at the moment, that's the plan. And this is the game. Thank you guys for watching. Please drop the video like if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more GTA content. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next one.